Hello YouTube, I'm Aftal Freely from DigiTube and in this video I'm going to show you how to do the burst effect or dispersion effect in After Effects which looks like this. Okay, so I'm going to show you the original footage. I left the starting empty because I want to set this to the background because we also need background in this video and then of yourself doing this action. So go to After Effects, drag it so it can create a new composition after that you can just uh, remove the unwanted parts like I press the button of start and it shaked a little bit so I am removing that place for doing this video you need a tripod or you need to place it in some way that it will not move okay so now you can just duplicate this just duplicate this video because this one is going to be the background now I'm going to rename it to BG and that will want to video but you can rename it anything you want I just like BG and video so in BG we want to find a place where there is nothing in it it is empty background okay so this is empty now right click on it and then in time select freeze frame now it is a background the BG is now a background so now select a place where you you want to do the effect and then go to edit and select your video first and then click split so there will be a second video right click on it and in time click freeze frame okay so now we can just take the pen tool which masks thing so I'm going to mask myself okay so this is going to take long time so I'm just going to make it fast forward okay as you can see just select your body okay okay now I have this and go to effects and presets and search for CC scatterize CC scatterize drag it and put it on yourself which is the masked video so in scatterize click on the timer it becomes blue when it's clicked and then go forward where you want to finish it so I want it till here and set it to 1000 okay so now we have the dispersion effect but the particles are not fully disappeared okay so we have the dispersion effect so now we just need to go to transform under the video 2 and then click on the timer of opacity and go further after the you know the scatterize effect and then set it to zero so it will finish after it is scatterized so now you just play the video and here we have the dispersion effect so this is the tutorial. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this. Peace out.